In this example, we're going to look at a trickier composite function question. Given f of x is equal to 3 over 1 plus x, find a formula for f of f of x. So in this case, what we're doing is we're taking this function and putting it inside itself. So whenever you see an x, you put in this function. So I'm replacing that x here with 3 over 1 plus x. So taking all of that and putting it inside where x is. So I know f of x is equal to this bit here, so I'm going to replace that inside the brackets. So f of 3 over 1 plus x. I'm going to then look at this and say, right, all of that goes there. So it will look like this. 3 over 1 plus that bit. Now to do this question, I'm going to go to the side here and do step 1 at the side. What I need to do firstly is get this denominator to a fraction all over a common denominator. I don't want 1 plus 3 over 1 plus x, I just want something over something else. So I have to change the 1 into something with a common denominator, so I've got denominator of 1 plus x. So that's what I'm going to do at the side here, I'm going to resort to doing a step at the side, it makes it working much easier and tidier. So 1 plus 3 over 1 plus x equals, to make that a denominator of 1 plus x, I need the same in the top so that it would cancel down to make 1. So that's going to be 1 plus x over 1 plus x. That's what this is as a common denominator of 1 plus x. I can now add the two things together because I've got a common denominator. So that's going to be 1 plus x plus 3 over 1 plus x. And then I can tidy up the top part there to x plus 4 over 1 plus x. So that whole bottom bit can be written as x plus 4 over 1 plus x. If I had the same in the top, this idea in the top, I would do this again for the top part of the fraction. So now I have this situation here, 3 divided by x plus 4 over 1 plus x, which looks a bit complicated. And again, I'm going to go to the side here to deal with this. An easier way to write that is 3 divided by all of this. So write it sideways. 3 divided by x plus 4 over 1 plus x. And from a fraction knowledge, I should know that to divide by this, you multiply and flip it over. So that's the same as 3 over 1, if you like, to make it easier. 3 over 1 divided by that, which is 3 over 1 times 1 plus x over x plus 4. Try and put brackets around, it really helps when you multiply it through. You might forget, otherwise you might do 3x and forget about the 4. The 4 is also multiplied by the 3. So that's going to end up as 3 plus 3x over x plus 4. And that's what this comes to, just by working sideways it becomes much easier. And there's your answer.